up guys i know a lot is happening right now in the world it's happening around us and we have every reason to be depressed right i've found myself on the pathway you know on that bridge of depression um stylishly dancing as zone to unrest on the bridge of depression I had to tell myself no way we can't go down that lane we need to come back so how do you handle um, all the negative things happening around you and not get depressed and not get depressed Number one thing I believe is when you start to compare yourself with other people, people you think you are on the same journey and for some whatever reason they are ahead of you, the moment you start to compare yourself, chances that you get depressed is extremely high. So what do you do? See, you are enterprise you. Your journey is different from mine. You need to embrace what God is doing in your life. Take learnings from people, don't get me wrong, all right? You can see people that we see as models and we learn from them, but don't put yourself in the position where you start to compare yourself. When you do that, you know what you're saying? God, you made a mistake when you made me. When you chose this journey for me, you weren't thinking, oh God, what were you thinking about? I mean, why would you do this to me? But guess what, you are you. Your story is unique, the, your, your reach is unique. No one can be you. So in order not to get depressed, number one, stop comparing yourself. Number two, start to appreciate your journey. Appreciate the things you've been through. Do you know you've been through a lot of stuff and you're not dead? You came out, you came out of it. Even if you wish you'd have done better, but you've learned. And there's certain things you won't do again. I believe God for you. So guys, stop comparing yourself, appreciate yourself, and focus on your strength. Focus on those things that gives you joy. Focus on those things that can, you know, help you become better and start to develop yourself. And above all, find a way to be thankful. Find a way to rejoice. Find a way to laugh. Find a way to celebrate. That's what I do when I feel that way. And yes, I do get that way at times. I'm like, no, I can't walk down that road. And I talk myself out of it. What do you do with your mouth? Instead of just gisting, gossiping, well, I hope you don't gossip. <laughs> Instead of just gisting away and saying also, why don't you open your mouth and begin, and begin to confess the right things? Why don't you testify in advance? Why don't you say the things you want to say? Why don't you stand in front of the mirror and tell yourself how great you are and just celebrate yourself? When you do that back and forth, you know, stop comparing yourself, appreciate yourself, appreciate your gift, um, celebrate yourself, you will be fine. And above all, let the Holy Spirit help you. I love you guys. I'm praying with you. And remember, you can reach me on Instagram at talktoimisi or send me a mail at talktoimisi at gmail.com. I want to hear from you. If you have questions or you want areas you want me to talk about, let's do it together. I love you and see you next time.